Hi, everybody. Welcome to Trader on the Streets Skills Challenge for this week. I'm Todd and uh, excited to uh, take you through the Tokyo Twilight Trading Challenge. And uh, this is a challenge that's going to specifically focus on the Tokyo trading session, which means that you're going to be trading it between the GMT hours of 2300 and 8 o'clock. So 2300 and 8 o'clock, you want to look at that on your chart to see when that is, make sure you're trading it for the right uh, time, those uh, those trading hours. So um, check that out. But this is going to really have you focus on um, that specific uh, time frame for those challenges. Now, you don't have to trade the Japanese yen during that. And, and so this can be done with any currency pair. Let's go through the conditions that you're going to be uh, using on this. First of all, uh, it's got to be four trading days for the week, not consecutive. It could be, you know, it doesn't have to be in a row, just four days out of the week. Uh, you got to execute the trades between 2300 and uh, 8 o'clock GMT, open and close during those times. Uh, you're going to execute a minimum of three trades on each of those four days that you trade. So you got to do at least, uh, what is that, uh, 12 trades that, uh, that you have to do. Uh, there's not a requirement that you hold them for um, a certain amount of time. There's not a requirement for uh, the size of it. So just three trades, four days out of the week, uh, open and close between 2300 GMT and 8 o'clock GMT. Um, and so, again, any currency pair can be used. Now, just a couple of things as we look at this. I know this is kind of small, but you'll uh, you can zoom in on this if you want to pause it. But adaptability to market session dynamics, you're going to focus on uh, what, how that, how the Tokyo sessions work. So take some time to look at some of the news that's coming out. Take some time to look at um, what uh, what events might be uh, affecting the Tokyo session at that time. Um, time constraint trading decision making. So sharpen your abilities to make fast, informed decisions, executing trades efficiently within the limited hours of the Tokyo trading session that you have. Understanding the overnight market movements, acquire insight into the impact of global market events uh, on that uh, Tokyo session. Uh, strategic planning and execution. So success in, in anything really hinges on the swift identification and the leveraging of the trading opportunities. So make sure that you have your rules for when you're going to get in, when you're going to get out. Again, we're, we're trying to learn skills from this. And so by putting together your, your trading strategy is going to help you understand what um, you're going to be doing to get in and to get out of that, making sure that you're using risk management uh, during that time so that you don't take too big of positions. Um, analyzing the shorter term market trends will help you identify when you should be getting in. Of course, uh, emotional, psychological uh, discipline is important and uh, important to, after you're done with that session, kind of reflect to see how you might be able to do better the next uh, the night when you do the, the Tokyo trading session. So those are some things that, uh, that you're going to be working on in terms of skills. So this uh, is going to uh, offer an opportunity to deepen your market understanding of uh, this Tokyo trading session. Um, and so again, rule number one, you can trade any currency pair on a minimum of four trading days throughout the challenge week, execute at least three trades per day, and then all trades, oh, I'm missing my L, A here, all trades must be open and closed within the same Tokyo session, adhering strictly to the session trading hours. That's really the focus. When that trading session, 2300 uh, GMT time starts, you want to open it and you want to close it before 8 o'clock GMT uh, time the next uh, the next trading day. So, um, But open and close in that same time. All right, guys. So that is the Tokyo Twilight Trading Challenge uh, for the Skills Challenge at Trader on the Street. Uh, good luck with it. And uh, we will talk to you in our next challenge.